Hello, my friends at New Braunfels. I want to give you a report. You know, the mission of Iran Alive is to transform Iran into a Christian nation, one soul at a time, and it's based on God's promise in Jeremiah 49, 38. And it's already happening, and you have an important part in it. You know, since the revolution started, the protest last September, as you may know, it was led by women. Many, many came to uh, on the streets and many were killed, but the revolution is continuing. What did we do? From day one, we had a meeting. We changed the content of our broadcast and what we share with them through media. You know, gospel has to be relevant to people's lives, people's daily lives. And that's what we did. We changed, we updated our messaging from the Bible, yes, but relevant to their lives. And we have seen many people's lives changed and many have come to Christ. As a matter of fact, after 23 years of being on the air, you know, we just passed the number 100,000. 100,000 registered salvation. These are people who have contacted us to receive Christ. And you know what? Out of these 100,000, there has been more who have come to Christ the last three years than the previous 20 years. So there is an acceleration in the work of the Holy Spirit in Iran and bringing Iranians to the gospel. Would you pray for us? Many of you are praying, and I appreciate that. We are facing the dark prince of Persia in Iran. We need your prayers. We need the protection for our people, for our leaders inside Iran, underground leaders, and also pray for us. Pray for wisdom and also pray for support and provision by God. You know, uh, the giving has come down somewhat since the last year, but we look up to the Lord. He, this is the ministry from Him, through Him, and for Him. Now, would you pray that the Lord will provide for Iran alive through His children, through His people? Once again, I want to thank you. I want you to invite you to come to Dallas and see us. And I hope to see you in New Braunfels very soon. I want to encourage you, if you have not received or you're not receiving our uh, newsletter, please don't forget, don't forget, go on our website, iranalive.org and sign up for our emails or newsletters or both. I love what I wrote for this July's newsletter. An amazing testimony touched my heart and I wrote it down for you. Make sure you read July's newsletter. It's going to touch your heart. Hope to see you soon. God bless you.